uh, create beans, uh, beans for certain type of analysis uh, is very uh, helpful. Uh, for instance, uh, suppose you want to break down all your revenues in beans, you know, every $10, you know, you have a lot of small transactions and large transactions, and you see how many of transactions is, is into different um, buckets of your measure. Uh, before to create beans, you'd have to use desktop. Now on the web, you can you can choose a measure, choose create, and choose beans. So here comes the little wizard, revenues, revenues, bean. And then let's say I want to see break in beans of $10 in this case. You know, I could ask the tool to suggest how many beans to break up. But in this case, I'm going to choose beans of $10 each. So when I create this bin, now I have a revenues bin here that is being created automatically. And if I drag to my rows, so what is, the, let me sort descending. So what, what this is do, doing is uh, from all invoices from uh, revenues from zero to $10, I have about um, 320,000 records from 10 to $20 is about uh, 247,000 records. They just put the uh, number of records as labels, so probably a little easier to read this. So how many records I have for transactions between seven and $80, 24,000. So pretty much creating revenue, you know, beans from measures was only available on desktop, now is also available um, on the web browser.